Hello everyone, welcome to the channel Rad here from Rad Tarot and this is going to be weekly tarot reading for Aries Sun, Aries Moon and Aries Rising <clears throat> July 20, uh, 30th to August 5th 2018. So the first card for Aries is which marking up the topic of uh, that week, this is going to be the Six of Pentacles. Then we do have the core of the situation here, that will be the World card. Afterwards is going to be uh, the challenges that Aries needs to overcome during that particular week. This is going to be the Tree of Wands. And the last one is going to be the Strength card. Alright. So, <clears throat> what we have is the Six of Pentacles. Now, Six of Pentacles is one of the cards which highly variates depending on the on the people's uh, situation where they're finding themselves at but one thing which is in common with the six of pentacles is that it is a, about resolving ongoing uh, issues that one do has either uh, through using their own creativity and finding resources even cornered by the wall or either uh, using someone else's help to uh, to obtain those kind of resources regardless of that the issues needs to be resolved either uh, you know negotiations agreements um, or just predicaments that you that you Aries may have in order to uh, execute certain relationship or to execute a certain project uh, that doesn't really matter what matters here guys is that you have to seriously consider how you're going to cope with those kind of things you're finding annoying and with those kind of things which find which you find very hard to cope with in a sense of that they are not really your passion and that is the uh, kind of like annoying side of one's job you know for example paperwork um, you know or just dealing with your boss if you want to say it that way or it could be as well you know the uh, bad side of the character of your partner if we're talking about one relationship but the bottom line here is is that you need to do these things because we do have the world card into a core of the situation which uh, kind of speaks for a, a total completion and starting on a, a new or embarking on a, a new perspective and that's why that week you need to um, Aries kind of like sort everything out that you do have until this very moment so you can face that a uh, new perspective coming in your way uh, with uh, much more uh, liberty than usual so you need to have much more freedom than, than you do have right now so you can kind of unfold if you want to if you want to say it that way your yourself your creativity and basically explore many options available now the world card is also about honesty and when it comes to when it comes to honesty is also important you know to not uh, to not kind of like transfer problems from the past into this new perspective that you are going to emerge um, after that week is over you know and it is important guys that you are totally pure when it comes to you know <clears throat> new paths uh, regarding your life and then we do have the uh, challenges that you need to overcome which is uh, tightly um, kind of like connected with the new perspective here we do have the three of wands which points that you need to kind of like place further challenges in front of yourself so you can improve either career wise or either relationship wise but if you cannot solve your already current problems and current issues that are bothering you how you are going to place new challenges it's kind of impossible if you can't overcome even those challenges that you are facing right now that being said the three of wands also speaks that you need to establish a certain patterns and obviously if you cannot overcome the problems you do have right now uh, or you don't want to overcome them it, it means that something with creating patterns isn't right at your behalf and you have to seriously consider your ways very important to be said with the three of wands as well is that this card may represent a, a new door opens uh, which opens for you all right but it because it's in a challenging position means that the window is going to be rather short and you have to be quite vigilant in order to take it and lastly we do have the guidance which the tarot card has and the strength speaks for itself uh, about being not exactly being strong but rather being more 
um, humbled and patient when it comes to coping with those undertaking difficulties you may facing right now and kind of like puts a resolution upon them. The strength card points to as well that with aggression nothing can be really resolved especially when it comes to negotiations. It rather you need to kill the opposition with a strong presence, with kindness and with lack of necessity to explain yourself. That is very, very important. If you go to an explanatory regime, that means that you are guilty of something. Do not explain yourself for the things you want to do. That being said, Aries, this was your weekly tarot reading for July 30th to August 5th, 2018. I hope you enjoyed it and you liked it. And in case you're interested in a private reading with me, everything you need to know about it will be listed down there in the description of this video. Rat signing out now. See you next time. Bye.